And here today we have a 2008 Dodge Ram 1500 Bighorn Edition um, crew cab, two-wheel drive pickup truck. Um, really nice truck, local trade-in. Um, it's got aftermarket wheels on it. Um, almost new tires, looks like. Uh, it's got uh, the uh, bull bar, I guess you call it, on the front. It's got an ARE bed cover on it. Uh, runs and drives really nice. Uh, we put two or three hundred miles on this vehicle ourselves and um, really seems to be a good running truck. And I'm going to go ahead and do a quick walk around video here and kind of show you any rust or dings, dents, things like that as we go around the vehicle. Like I said, these tires appear to be almost new. Um, lots of tread left there. And then it has these aftermarket wheels on it. And these are. It looks like I believe 17 inch yeah 17 inch wheels as fog lights The tires are a Cooper Discover, Discover AT3 looks like. rockers and everything look like they're pretty decent just a little bit of rust but not bad looks like we got a little bit here on the bottom of this door I see a bubble right there all the way on the bottom of it there this bedside right here looks like somebody has repainted like the front part of it right here and I can just tell there's a slight imperfection in the paint right there uh, where it's been repainted and you can see uh, the rust bubble here uh, coming up from behind that fender flare very common spot for the dodges to rust i know both sides um, you can see a little bit of bubbles there the other side's just barely showing over the fender flare but it's got this are bed cover on it really nice got a few chips here on this corner the spoiler looks like Little rest spot there on the back bumper. It's got like little lift cylinders on it there. Bed liner. Two inch Reese hitch. Uh, looks like a seven pin light hook up here. Another little rust spot there on that corner. And it looks like there's a spot right here that's been touched up. Somebody's graced something there on that back corner. If there's a few like scratches like that there, try to get the light right, you see that. Just kind of all the way around the bed of the pickup truck mainly, just little scratches like that right there. Another little scratch right there. It's got uh, Raptor um, Nerf bars on it. Let's go ahead and take a look inside here. It is a cloth interior, uh, nice and clean inside. Gray cloth, has a fresh smell to it. The vinyl on the side of this here looks like it's just cracking 
Pretty slide in and out right there. Power windows, power locks, power mirrors. Let's jump on in here. Start it up. There are no check engine lights on, ABS light, airbag, anything like that. Just my seatbelt light on up there right now. 148,776 miles. Engine sounds good, drives real nice. Looks like we have cruise control here. Um, over here is our climate controls. It does have the uh, power rear sliding um, window in the rear here. That is power. And it does work there. AM FM CD, auxiliary input. Got a compass up here with the temperature on it. Down here you have cup holders. Um, this console here does fold down. If you'd like to have armrests. It's got some storage in here as well. Or you can tilt it up and you'll have seating for six in here. Couple power outlets. Let's take a look in the back seat. Really nice and clean back there. Has the RAM floor mats on each side. And we'll take a look under the hood here. It has the 4.7 V8. Uh, we just gave it a fresh oil change. Engine sounds good. Well, for more information, you can give us a call or visit us online at heritagemotorsales.com.